Hello everyone, welcome to Madhouse. Uh, got a little bit of a riddle for you. What's better than 131? 231s! Woo! <laughs> Okay, everyone, here's the new addition to Madhouse. This will be a ongoing project. Never mind the space savers, that's not what we're gonna run. Um, but yeah, Terry, how good's this? We got a great um, looking 31 here. Uh, we're gonna be putting a motor and a box in it. And <coughs> as you can see, uh, nothing yet, but really in a nutshell, it's time to, you know, slowly start chipping away at this and get an engine in there and a box and hopefully start uh, getting this thing ugh, on track. So a big shout out to Josh. Um, Josh, mate, if you're watching, thank you so much. We appreciate uh, your support and allowing us to um, have a crack at this and giving us the opportunity to uh, take this car further. So thank you very much, Josh. That's uh, unreal, mate. And Hopefully in the near future, uh, we'll get you back in this car. So um, either way, we're just gonna tinker away today on uh, the 31 in here. Terry's been working hard as usual, uh, got the rear coilovers in, and I think we're just gonna get the box in now. So we'll try and film as much as we can. There's just got to be a way out of here. <laughs> We got a fair few wheels that came with the car guys. So we're just gonna test fit my existing rotors that I use on the AU. Um, this has been tubbed. So these are a very wide wheel, they're 9.5. So we're gonna do a test fit now and just see, you know, if, if they fit, then that's great. That means it's uh, another set of wheels that we can kind of use. Uh, so yeah, let's just see how she looks. Okay, so we've whacked it on and listen, there, it's a really good looking wheel and it looks particularly good, but it's all a matter of perspective. So here, it's looking good. And over here, <laughs> it's looking even better. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty dope, but we do have to run um, 10 mil spaces for the clearance. It is a very wide rim, it's 9.5. So what was happening is just the tire was rubbing on the coilover up there so listen we're not sure what we're going to do here um you know we might be able to swap the wheels or maybe just put a a tire that's a little bit more narrow this is a, a, a two four five so maybe a two three five will give us a little bit of clearance but listen it, it does look pretty awesome and things with budget track cars and stuff like that you want to want to try and use every single uh piece of material that you have um, until you can't. So yeah, I guess we'll kind of have a think about it and see kind of what we want to do. So yeah, kind of in two minds at the moment, but whatever, we'll just kind of have a chat about it and yeah, see what our thoughts are. But hey, it looks good. Okay, um, quick update. We had a bit of a problem where we popped the tail shaft in and uh, she wasn't spinning, so we were a little bit worried. Obviously, you know, we popped the gearbox in and the tail shaft and we were worried we, we would have to kind of take everything out, but all good. It was just uh, the rear brakes seized, so we just popped them off. She's spinning and the tail shaft Too is- Too many burnouts. <laughs> Um, yeah, the tail shaft is spinning, so uh, all good. We thought we had uh, quite a nasty problem, but uh, handbrake off, calipers off, and uh, she's spinning really well.
Ooh, all right, bit of a milestone. Uh, the skyline is rolling, so the meshes look really nice on it. And listen, Terry just randomly kind of selected the coilover height, and at the moment, to be honest, they're sitting quite well. Uh, obviously, it might sink a little bit over uh, the next few days. You know, they do kind of go down a couple of mil, but listen, she's looking pretty minty fresh. We're gonna kind of, <laughs> we're gonna try and move everything around. So, uh, and fingers crossed we can fit both the 31s in here. Woo hoo. We are done. The 31s are in. Uh, it looks fantastic. It's um, a sight that we haven't seen a lot of lately, so it's fantastic to see pretty much two identical 31s in the same spot. Sight, two 31s. Give me that. Can you open that for me, Brad? Thanks, man. So, well deserved beer. Yeah. Cheers. What well up, mate? Cheers, you Good effort. You know, although um, I guess we've sacrificed a little bit of room, uh, listen, they're undercover. There's still enough room to kind of do what we need to do. We'll do a little tidy up, but Madhouse is looking really good at the moment. So yeah, until um, the next video, not sure what we'll do on the next one, but uh, I don't know. What do you reckon? I reckon we'll be picking up the motor for this. Motor for this, yep, all right, cool. Um, and then hopefully, yeah, in the near future, we can get these running. So, little update, Terry picked up this beautiful number from, um, from Facebook Marketplace. So, uh, Italian made, I believe it's a Luisi. So, really nice wheel, as you can see the difference there. I'm not a uh, deep dish guy, that's Yeah, all. this kind of brings everything to the front a little bit more. And I, yeah, I think it looks uh, absolutely top notch. So, yeah, uh, thank you for watching. As you can see, it's, um, it's all happening and hopefully uh, we can get at least the Road 31 running and we will do some videos on the Track 31 in the near future but I think the main focus is this for now. We'll keep you all posted and uh, yeah, once again, see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Yeah.